Hi, this is a short video on the best way to remove a Kyocera KX driver from uh, your computer. It is not recommended that you remove it from here in the driver set. You don't want to just right click and remove from, or highlight and remove from there. Uh, it will cause some, some issues. The best way to do it is actually running the Kyocera uninstaller. So in the driver here, in the driver, you can actually download the uninstaller by itself. It's over here. Or if you want it, it's a little bit easier if you use the product library. So once the product library is on, you accept and say OK. Then you go to uninstall. It will show you all the drivers that you have on there. So for instance, if I want to remove these drivers, all I do is select them and tell it to uninstall and then it goes through and uninstalls all the proper files that need to be uninstalled. If you just remove the driver from the uh, server uh, driver uh, the spot there where the, all the drivers, the print drivers reside, you will have issues trying to uh, reinstall it. But once you're done, you say finish and when you exit out of here, Let's go back to where they have this and let's just highlight something so this will show up and when you go into driver, all the drivers, the uh, the, the drivers for the Kyocera and KX drivers are gone. If you have any questions, please put them below in the comments.